Hi, my name is Katie Torpy, and I'm the writer director of the movie Truth About Carrie. It's an independent film that we shot in County Kerry, Ireland in 2004. We took 20 cast and crew members to this small Irish fishing village on the southwest coast. At the time, I was married to the producer. I'm divorced now. I also, at the time, I was 130 pounds heavier than I am right now. Our lead actress was a nobody, and she's now on a TV show. We had no budget. We were there in pouring down rain. Everyone was living in rooms together. We were shooting on the fly, working long hours. But it was a real amazing mesh pot of filmmaking and learning how to make movies. And also being in a culture and an environment of Ireland, which is completely different than the States, and capturing beautiful footage and just a really amazing experience for everyone involved. It was true independent filmmaking at its best. Truth About Carrie is a story about a American girl who goes to Ireland and is found dead a week later, washed ashore on a beach, and her best friend comes to Ireland several months later to find out what really happened to her. It's about the secrets of a small village. It's about being an outsider, and this is a journey of one woman's tale of trying to figure out what happened to her best friend and the wild ride she experienced while going to Ireland, meeting these people, being in this different culture, and realizing that nothing is what it seems. We had been searching for several months for the lead actress in our movie. We couldn't find her. We'd been looking at every actress in LA. And we finally had a casting session one day and this girl walked in, and within seconds, the casting director, my husband, the producer, myself, we all were watching, we're like, she is magic. We taped her, she did her audition. Couldn't believe she was as good as she was, so we cast her in the movie. Like, thanked God that she walked into our lives. And now she's on a hit show. But we saw talent walk into the room and just be there, and she blew everyone else away. I remember our DP walking into the meeting for the first time, and he had a Celtic book that was where he wrote all his notes and everything. And then he had brought different pictures from magazines and stuff that he thought the movie would look like, and they were amazing. His eye was insane. And I'd already seen his reel, and I wanted him anyway, and they walked in that meeting, I'm like, he's it. And every time he pointed the camera, he would get this beautiful shot and just capture Ireland. He made the movie look amazing. This movie really symbolized my rock bottom in my life. And if you watch the footage and you really look at it, I was really, really unhappy. About six months after we finished making this movie, I went and I left LA to kind of find myself. And I got healthy, changed everything and regrouped. My husband and I got divorced. I lost a lot of weight. Now I'm ambitious, I'm happy. Losing the weight, the best thing I ever did. The best part about making independent film is the people involved who you're connected with and collaborate with. And if you have a great team, it's amazing. It really is um, an incredible process. It's rewarding, fulfilling, and usually the end result is a great movie. We're proud of this movie. It was an independent film and we pulled it off. We all learned a lot. And I walk away from this experience as a life lesson of learning how to really make a movie. Uh, with no money, with a lot of different personalities and people, and how to be strong and fight for my vision and um, make something I'm proud of. Um, that's what's really important.